In this video, specimen preparation is demonstrated. You will be provided with a reconstituted fine-grained soil sample, i.e. clay sample, and the following instruments for preparation of soil specimen. A soil lathe, wire saw, and plexiglass disc. First, expose the soil sample from the plastic wrap. In the odometer ring, there will be one sharpened edge with a groove, as well as a blunt edge. Place the sharpened edge of the odometer ring on top of the soil sample and make a slight indent onto the sample. This is to identify the excess portions to be trimmed before placing the sample in the soil lathe. Using the wire saw, trim the size of the sample to a size that will fit on the circular base of the soil lathe. Trimming must be done slowly and carefully to ensure minimal disturbance to the sample. Gently place the trimmed sample on the circular base of the soil lathe. Start trimming the sides of the sample by sliding the wire saw along the guiding edges of the soil lathe. You should be aiming to produce a sample that is more or less cylindrical in shape. The guides on the soil lathe will ensure that a cylindrical sample having a diameter slightly larger than that of the ring is achieved. Carefully position the ring with the sharp cutting edge on the sample and place the recessed plexiglass disc on top of the ring. Push down with the soil lathe ram until a sufficient height of the soil sample emerges out into the recess of the plexiglass disc. Using the wire saw, Remove the soil around the odometer ring and collect some of the side trimmings into one of the metal containers. These trimmings will be used for the determination of moisture content. The circular base of the soil lathe can be removed. Carefully pick it up and shear the specimen off the base as shown. Carefully trim the sample. Flush with the thick blunt edge of the odometer ring using the wire saw. Upon each trimming, remember to clean the wire saw to reduce the sample disturbance during the trimming process. Place a sample of the bottom trimmings into the second metal container, and these trimmings will be used for the determination of the moisture content. Place the trimmed surface over a piece of plastic wrap. Now trim the top of the specimen flush with the sharp edge of the odometer ring. Place a sample of the trimmings into the third metal container for the determination of moisture content. Clean the outside surface of the ring using a paper towel. Measure and record the mass of the soil specimen with the odometer ring. The soil specimen that is held within the odometer ring is now ready to be placed in the odometer cell that you will be assembling. Place all three containers in the oven for drying for approximately 24 hours. Later you will measure the weight of the container again to determine the dry weight of the clay samples. This information will allow you to calculate the moisture content of your specimen. You will need to determine the moisture content from the top, sides, and bottom trimming separately. Place the specimen at the center of the bottom porous plate. Note that the sharp edge of the rings should be facing upward. Place the positioning ring and secure it with the two nuts. Carefully place the top porous plate cap assembly and ball on the specimen. 